Right, hello everybody, it is Ordinal Wolf, and today we are back in Minecraft. Uh, so, uh, I did talk to you guys about, well, in my kind of cam video, that I would like to start a different series away from RLcraft, just because it was a little bit too difficult. Um, so, as you can see, we're in a new Minecraft world, and this is, surprisingly, Minecraft 1.14. So as you can see, I've got a couple of mods installed, um, so today we are playing, actually, with the FTB Unstable 1.14 pack. So, in particular, this mod pack adds 145 mods to the game. Um, there's a combination of machines, um, a little bit of magic, some food and whatnot. So uh, it's it's all very brand new, so it's not uh, going to be completely perfect. So if anything crashes or anything, um, expect that. That's just going to happen. Um, but... Without further ado, let's just get straight into it. Um, now, the only thing that I've added, which isn't normally in this pack, is once again just ore excavation. Uh, ore excavation, as I've said in previous videos, is like one of those things I can't really live without. It's like just mining everything all together and it just makes life so much easier because you don't have to mine every single individual block but anywho let's uh let's get some wood i'm also going to use the vein mining key to do this as well oh. previously mentioned lag and such things will happen turn auto jump off because of stupid 1.14 reasons uh, let's get ourselves some more wood. Uh, any good stuff? We get an apple. I guess that's probably a good thing. Now, as you can see, we've got an enigmatic amulet, which this is actually given to you upon um, entering the world. And basically, you can add that to your a curios slot. Ooh. And we just dropped it on the ground. Right, let's uh, equip that. And as you can see, that gives us a little bit of armor. As well as, let's have a quick look, eh? Um, you still don't know its origin and purpose, blah, blah, blah. So we get 1.5 plus attack damage plus 2 armor. So that 2 armor, so 1 armor is half an armor bar thing. So I guess that kind of makes sense. Oh, there's a massive as ravine over here. Yo! What's this over here? Damn, one big ravine. Right. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys one other new thing that's in this mod pack. So, as you can see here, I've got this blueprint package. Um, if we just, uh, actually, sorry, we just need to right click on it. We get given all of these. So we get given these different blueprints. So you get a uh, sword blueprint, uh, uh, pickaxe blueprint, axe blueprint, shovel blueprint. So... What we're going to do is we're going to turn some of these oak wood uh, logs into oak planks. We're going to put three of them in our crafting table and then combine them with that. And then we get a wood pickaxe head. And then if we combine that with a, uh, a tool rod, so the stick, you actually gain a pickaxe. So this is from Silent Gear. Um, so this is one of Silent Gems, or sorry, uh, Silent, I think it's, is it Silent Chaos or something? Um, it's one of his mods, and basically, it allows you to make gears, tools, and stuff out of various items nicely and easily. And, um, just using all ore excavation there again, we can mine a whole buttload of stone, and then we can make ourselves a stone pickaxe, which is very cool. Um, so now we have a stone pickaxe, it's time to get some iron, get that nice and early on in. Oh, there's a whole lot of stalactites and pebbles, and that's kind of cool, I guess. Let's get ourselves some coal, it's always um, good to start off with some coal. Um, yeah, let's, let's do some resource mining. Now, I think a cool thing for this series could be just, um, I guess... Trying not to die as much as possible and um, get through finishing the game, like, you know, beating the Ender Dragon and stuff and 
possibly finding a village and all that good stuff. Oh, here we go. We've got some sapphires from Blue Power. So Blue Power is another one of the mods. Um, now this is actually that's actually a port of a mod that used to be um, a very classic mod in Minecraft. So I guess if you were to look at mods from Minecraft times, uh, a lot of the mods that I remember are from uh, mod packs such as Ticket Classic and FTB Unstable and all all that good stuff from back in the day of like 1.4, um, and it, you know. Blue Power was one of those in Ticket Classic, which allowed you to um, have like advanced redstone signals and whatnot. It was real cool, and it definitely added to the experience of playing Minecraft, along with a lot of the other mods that were in that mod pack. It was absolutely amazing, and I gotta say, I enjoyed every single piece of it. Still to this day, I love that pack, and I've revisited it multiple times. If you guys actually want to see um, a revisitation of um, said Ticket Classic pack, or maybe a um, revisit of, say, the updated tickets, uh, let me know, because they're actually uh, lots of fun. Um, you know, the, a lot of the mods, you know, allow you to do lots of cool stuff, so we could definitely get into that. Ooh, it's a double, double ravine. Ooh, damn. This looks cool, let's see. Okay, so there's some like lava and stuff, and there's a creeper over there. So, yeah. Oh, marble from Blue Power. Okay. We probably want to. We've got enough cobblestone. We can definitely make ourselves a uh, crafting station. So, crafting station, a mod that basically tries to copy the uh, Tinker's Construct uh, crafting station. And that's about it. Um, I think we also have some kind of like tiny coal chunks, um, so we'll use those, we'll get ourselves some iron. Now with uh, these other blueprints we can actually create um, stone sword blade and cross guard and I reckon if we add a stick then we can get a stone sword. Cool. Um, so now we have a stone sword as well. Oh, I can hear someone burning. Hello? Right, so we've got a relatively full inventory. At some point we probably want to um, get like a, I guess, what would you call it? Um, oh wait, yeah, sorry, actually this is another thing that you can actually do. You can actually just upgrade the head on your pick. And there you go. Ta-da! Um, sorry. So, um... We actually probably want to get out of here because we, we need a bed and we don't have one of those yet. And I can hear lots of things. Well, I can hear things and it sounds like they might try to come for us soon. We need to find some sheep. Sheepkins. Oh, shit. Scaly bum. We need to find... Oh, uh, witch as well. Shit. We don't have much. Um, where, where, where are the sheeps at? Where are all the sheeps at? Dun 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 dun. Ooh, rabbits with dapper coats and the top hats. It's kind of cool. Spiders dying from a cactus over there. I wish we could find um, a village. That would be cool. Oh, I can see a mushroom off in the distance. That's kind of cool. Um, ooh. What the fuck are you guys? Sandy Sea Captera. Farlanders? <gasps> oh no. Nope. No, bitch. Nope. 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 Bitch, run. Run. What is this? I see lots of Endermen. And is that like an ender slime? What the fuck? Okay. What the fuck is an ender slime, man? Um, I, cool, I guess. Okay, gnarly. Uh, let's just uh, carry on, I guess. And uh, we'll see if we can find somewhere to go. 
Hey, Mr. Squiddy. You know, what I really would like to find is a village. I'd love to go start life in a village. Because that's basically what 1.14 is all about, right? Kind of getting to a village and having some fun with the villagers and... Oh, shit. Scalabomb! Oh, no, and I can hear those annoying things again. Shit, stop shooting at me, bitch. Um... We don't have anything to eat. We need to find some stuff to eat. Um, I can't eat loo mushrooms. No. There's a there's a pig over there. Pig, feed me your pork chops. I'm gonna come and kill you, bitch. Why does there have to be a spider right next to you as well? Oh, 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 oh. Ah! What the fuck is that? What the fuck? Why can't I get off? What the fuck, man? Not cool. Not cool. Not cool, man. Not cool. I didn't expect that to happen. That's fucked. Can you go away? I'm not interested right now. <sighs> Sheeps. We can make a bed. Right, sheep. Sheeps, stay put. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna drop some of this shit. Right, sheep, come here. Right, uh, quick. No, I, I don't have one of yours. Shit. Yeah, do we, uh, uh, eh. Eh. Eh, bed, sleep. Oh. Ah, zombies coming! Go away, you vile beast! Fuck off! Ooh, llamas! Hey, Mr. Llama! Ooh, you look very posh with your uh, hat, your monocle, and your bow tie, and your mustache, and your pipe. Oh, oh, okay. Um, didn't. Okay, I want to get off. Help! <laughs> I want to get off. Go away! I, 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 let me out of here! I just want to. I want to find. Oh, I just want to get out of here. Looking for a village. Don't know where they are. Trying to find a village. What the fuck? There's a crocodile. What the fuck? Okay, no, not interested, not today. What the fuck? Nope. 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 And, uh, nope. What's that over there? Is, is that a village I spy in the distance? Let's head over this way and see what we have found. I see some kind of like, if that's sand, I'll be pissed, but if it's not, then I'll be much happy. I'll be much a happies. Looks like some kind of building. I think we may have found some, <gasps> it's a Farlander's hut. It's, it's definitely not a village, but something's better than nothing. Am I right? Right, let's go, let's go check this out, eh? Hello? What my what? Oh. Hello, Ender Golem. You don't seem to like me, do you? Hi there. Um. Ow! Ow! Boy, that's not nice. I don't want to get any closer to him because he's gonna kill me. This motherfucker. Let's just run away and leave that Farlander place alone. You guys can enjoy yourselves while I go find a village. Hey, Mr. Chicken. Uh, more lurking things. Not really interested. Please leave me be. I don't wish to die. I don't know why. Why I don't want to die, but... Uh, 
I just want to find a house to live in. Right, guys, what I think we'll do is we'll be back once I find a village, because, like, this is taking fucking for ages, but don't worry, I'm sure I'll find one soon. Alright, guys, then we're back, and look, oh my god, I think I... I've... Oh, there's, a, there's some cats and stuff, but I finally find a village! Way! Let's uh, get ourselves some good old-fashioned wheat. Uh, I, I, I want the wheat for now, not, not the seeds. I just... I need food, so... Um, hey guys, how's it going? No, you don't, you don't seem to like me too much. Um, how about you? Uh, wheat for emeralds? Okay. Um, okay, you just hold your stuff away here. Hello! It seems like there's, um, quite a nice place. Well, there's some nice houses and stuff up here. Maybe we could live with the villagers for a little bit. And uh, do some renovations on some of their places because some of them are a little bit small. That could be kind of cool. I quite like the idea of doing that. So I think that's what we'll do. Right, guys, that's it for this episode. Um, I hope you enjoyed. Um, so we're going to do a new series um, in this 1.14 world. So we're just going to explore some of the new mods which have been put out. And we're also going to just try and finish the game and get to the Ender Dragon boss, I guess. So, um, yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. Take it easy, and I shall see you in the next one. Right. Goodbye!